Hey guys. Hi. Hey. Uh, so I'm going to do a really quick video on the strength of the double-sided sticky tape. I'm going to do a demo for you. So we're going to take two pieces and stick them together. Yeah. So it's been interesting because a lot of people have, um, there have been quite a few folks and voices chiming in about the strength and choice of using the 3M tape for the camper. The funny thing I think people don't realize is a lot of automotive spaces use that 3M tape. It's more common than people think. I've just brought it to light because I'm making a camper with it. The automotive world uses it, buses use it, skyscrapers use it, and I know I said that in another video and everyone goes, the skyscrapers don't move. Have you seen a skyscraper move in high winds? They move, they move. Yeah, they're not vibrating down the road. I get that. But, hey, at least I can do this little example, right? I got two pieces here. So let's put some double-sided tape on it. Industrial strength! Hold on. Industrial strength! You're welcome. I even sing that song for you. Yeah. All right. Stuff is expensive, I hate to waste it. But I want to calm fears, because, well, whatever. <laughs> expensive, so I'm not gonna do more than that, okay? Okay, cool, all right, here we go. I'm trying to mimic exactly what we did before. Flat, nice, good, okay, ready, see? Into your tree. Damn. <laughs> I got a honey aluminum comb sandwich. You want one? Here. No? Okay. I'll eat it. Okay, whatever. That's what we'll vibes. Mm. Alright. We're replicating this as the best that we can. I need a bigger one, hold on. For science! <laughs> okay, look at that. Okay, so now the plan is I'm gonna let this cure set overnight because there's recommendations on the 3M website that supposedly there is an instant bond, but if you want the greatest strength bond, you let it go for 24 to 48 hours or so. In lieu of science, this thing's gonna sit for the next 24 hours. We'll be back tomorrow with more. It's just so people don't think I cheated. Today is the 14th. Happy Single Awareness Day. So we'll see you back tomorrow on the 15th. Check on the panels. Oh! I just spilled my coffee. <laughs> my day is going. I really did just spill my coffee. I really did. Okay. okay let's go find those panels. been 24 hours. Here, I'll show you. Here you go. It's the 15th. Okay, next day. <laughs> 24 hours. We're gonna see if we can pull this apart. Or how easily, or not easily, this thing will pull apart. hurts so much. Okay. For 
sides. Oh, I am bending it. I'm mutilating the panel before these things are coming apart. It's never going to work. So that was just two, remember, two pieces, two little strips. Now imagine a camper that has, oh, I don't know, 15, a dozen rolls of this stuff on it. They're going to fly off on the freeway. Yeah, are they? Shoot, because. You're supposed to come off on the freeway. Hurry up. I'm gonna break this uh, tool before I think these are gonna come apart. <sighs> I better not break James's tools. I think he'll be upset. I'm really trying here because I want them to fly off on the freeway like the internet tells me they're going to do. And I'm gonna bend and break this thing. Okay, what's next? And then I'll smash it with a hammer. Come here. Maybe I'm just weak. Maybe I'm just weak. Maybe I need to get James in here and um, try to separate these things. I just want you to come apart. I really do. <laughs> just do it. Just come on. Just. More, more, more pry bar. Yeah, that's it. Hold on. That's, that's the ticket. More pry bar. Ladies and gentlemen, we have separation. Oh, did that actually work? That worked. Gotta keep them separated. took so much effort to pull apart. So these are gonna fly off on the freeway in case you, uh, in case you. 